Okay. Oh, strategies I dipped out and lost. Connection force. That would explain why all my fingers went poof. Oh well. Okay. Oh, that would explain it. Oh. No, I guess that doesn't need to do anything. Hold D2. It's fine. We need to be a same. Next word. I'm just gonna not do it. Just gonna do that. Just shut up for now. Extract and then we have to extract the current text and that is the current. Okay, and so that should be it for the day of the component system now. I feel like. Oh, that is so simple. Alright, absolutely dangerous. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, um, what do you I have all the includes in here in my retail package. Space package. These are includes in retail. I have an include that I have to do. Retail. Oh, I know, I think I need It's just the... Oh, yeah. Let's see, it's the page. I have those. So, it's the text. So, I feel like the next thing that I really need to start focusing on is... Windowing? I want Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be done. Mm, just a little bit. Like Fifteen more minutes. About. Mm-hmm. It's nice that's turbo microwave. I like the turbo. 
Turn the microwave is good. Yeah, but I like the dial. It reminds me of my mom's microwave. And hers is a dial too. My mom's microwave, it's a dial. It's nice. I guess. Yeah, I'm good. Ow. Whoops. Man. This would be <laughs> um, graphics. I want food. Ugh, that's not how you spell that. Food. H. So I need a window. Shader. Shader. Frog. Okay. Um. The window, the shader, and the shader. Um, I need to make the and have a and G L F W window enter. Here. Yeah, because I'm going to have to take a look into how to get you. to be up and running. Let's see. So there's also going to be. Wait. Yeah, because the window, window, the shader, the shader program. Right, but do I want the window to be in here, or do I just want windowing to be? So, I think I want windowing to be. Because so. the game scene engine thing will have. And yeah, this game scene window will have its um thing because the game Yeah, because the, the rendering. Yeah, I was going to be owning the graphics. Well, the scene is going to have bad access to the graphics. And. The. In 
the thing is going to have to have access to the graphics. Because the scene is going to be in control of the scene is going to be in control of what kind of rendering that. Right, because the the scene will have the, the scene will either be screen space 2D screen space 3D world Space to be a world space 3D. Right. Um, and each of these are going to, you know, and all of these are going to have to have access to the graphics. Well, we're gonna have to have access to all the different render types. Which means that they're gonna have, a, have to have access to the shader program. Next, we're gonna have a GLU and ID. This is also going to have a once D um we have the public ID need to have do I want to have that? Do I want to set the source directly? Or do I want to. How do I do it? Okay, let's see here. Ban all these. Do I have the. Yeah, because these are going to be different types. The different Right, so all those can be wrapped up. Into things. It's going to be actual implementation. Okay, so in the game run loop, it does a fat stack of stuff. Cool. This is. Yeah, because we, we have the which there goes in with this. I think I both have the um concentrate source. I don't think I really need an enum the type. I mean Let's see. 
Because you do for those things. But I can inherit. I can have a bit of inheritance. Hmm, that's fine. Yeah, because then I can inherit a bunch of things. And then... These things. I mean, do I want to... Set it? And then have the thing? I mean, I could do that. I mean, I could do that. Um, because then I can have a shader pointer for pervert and pointer for type. I'm going to need to have uh, I need to Have a void catch all. I also need to have a void use um, and then here I'll have class. Fragment Fragment Shader Let's spend this wrong Shader And then also Vertex Public I guess I could also do this. Shader. Shader. Okay. Set. Class. Fragment. Um, just for the sake of my own sanity, I'll move that up there because this is the order in which everything is declared in open jail. What else needs to be done? That's the youth program. The actual graphics itself is going to be dealing with. Yeah, the actual graphics system itself is going to be dealing with actual drawing and updating, testing and everything. Uh, and there may be other things like SSBOs and VBOs. Mm -hmm. And VAOs might be a thing, but the way that I want to do this is without it. Um, or at least I can do an SSB. It might be a thing that I will need. Now let's look into that. Because I'll need a. I'll need to have a big fat buffer. All the objects that are being drawn because I'm not going to have meshes per se. Like I can, but I'm not going to. I want to kind of avoid the 
like standard way of rendering. So I want to not have the text. So I'm gonna have to have the verb text shader. And this is vertex shader. And here She probably can't call you. Do I really need to call you? The main thing that I want to do is a const char. SRC, SRC, and then here's const. Anchor. We will need those, and then here I will need to have the vertex shader pointer. Chad and uh, a friend shader pointer frag shad. Make those into that I need. Uh, oh wait, um, I mean this is shader. Okay, so I think I have everything set up for next stream in the way that I want, in the way that I want to, um, still feel like, oh, this is graphics, it's not, this is the shader. I mean, do I want all the graphics to be in one thing, or do I want to separate them? I think I, I will... Um, separating them, so shader.h, because I'll just, uh, see, um, because I'm just going to be renewing this. Let's double check and make sure that all this is good. Graphics. Cash. Include shader .h. Um, because this is going to need to be renamed. That's p. And then this is also going to be renamed to shader .h. Okay, all those are. John shader.h and shader.cpp include shader.h. Okay. All these are good to go. Hello! Milky Age. Oh, it's coming along. Um, he actually caught me right at the end of the stream, unfortunately. I'm just wrapping up a few things, setting things up for next stream. Um, I've reformatted like everything from the the GitLab repo um, and all that. I have a little bit of a strain issue, but I have re-implemented the... No. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I have been trying to do longer streams, but life exists. So, you know, that's a thing. Um, but yeah, I rewrote all the entity component system and I've split things up into a bunch of different uh, files so that it'll be a lot easier to manage and maintain later on down the road instead of having one megalithic header file with 
you know, 65,000 lines of code or whatever. So, anyway, um, that's pretty much all that I'm going to be doing this stream for now. Still think I made some pretty good progress. So, next stream should be getting the graphics up and running, I feel like. Graphics and windowing. Might change it just to straight up windowing. Because I feel like graphics is going to be set a little bit differently. So I think instead of graphics.cpp, I think it should be windowing.cpp. And windowing.h. Windowing. So the graphics. Um, that way I can separate windowing and rendering a little bit easier, I feel like. So yeah, that's going to be it for this one. Um, gonna commit all and save and commit. Yeah, you too. I uh, hope that you have a good day today. Anyway, uh, that'll be it for that. Bye bye, and we'll hopefully see you guys next time. Oh, and I also noticed that you were the last person who followed me, so thank you very much. Might as well give you that shout out before I actually end the stream. <laughs> anyway.